Hello Snoopies! Today I will show you what we're gonna pack for our trip to Thailand. It will be minimalistic because at the end you won't need so many things. I always create a list of the things I will need for sure and then I go through my wardrobe and pick out the items I really want to pack and then we have to sort out whether those are really necessary. This time I really considered how hot it is in Thailand and even though I have summer clothes but there are some which are also too warm for the hot and humid climate in Thailand. So they will stay at home. This is everything so far. Doesn't look much. Underwear. Oh, and this is my vision board. Do you know what a vision board is and do you also have one? So I will explain. This is the backpack itself. It's not really big. It's a little dusty. That means I haven't traveled enough in the last couple of months. So what goes in here uh, are my flip-flops. I won't be needing other shoes because um, on the flight I will wear my sneakers and this is the only time I will be needing closed shoes. And here's my passport and my smaller travel wallet and a neck pillow. This one is really good because you can really hang in there. I used to have a hard time sleeping on the plane, but with this neck pillow, it's really better. It's from Go. This all goes into my backpack, in the little backpack which I take on the plane as my hand luggage. First thing which goes in there is my beach towel. Um, we will be staying with my dear Thai friend in Bangkok. So she will provide towels and also in the accommodation on the islands uh, we will have towels. But I like to bring um, an extra one. Next items are three shorts. This is more than enough because you always have to consider uh, in Thailand you can get your clothes washed everywhere for very cheap money. Also two skirts, a shorter one and a longer one. Swimming suit. Yeah, I don't really have the bikini body yet. Two nicer shirts. Um, yeah, those are <laughs> it's the same cut. Um, they really flatter my figure. So I bought two. One in uh, stone and one in black. So five shirts in total. More than enough because I will be able to wash my clothes. This light sarong is uh, for walking on the beach. This I will wear on the flight. And what's this? This is um, my bra because um, I don't want to have straps. And this is a silicone bra, uh, important to cover your nipples in Thailand. Underwear goes here. I didn't bring the most beautiful underwear. Yeah, because in that climate it's just not necessary. And um, yeah, we will have the chance to change our underwear often because we will be able to wash it. So seven pairs might be enough. And the backpack is almost already full. So my beauty case goes in here as well. And then we have everything. Usually I have a case for my underwear. I bought it in South Africa, but I just cannot find it. I don't know where it is, but it will turn out. And this is what's in my beauty bag. Uh, I have some leftover non-vegan eyeshadow, mascara, my brush, toothpaste, toothbrush, razor. This is a deodorant. And my friend Katja bought me this travel kit. Uh, it's for skincare. It's all vegan. And I need my earplugs and the box for my retainer. What's missing now is shampoo and sunscreen. I will have to purchase that before we leave. 
And not to forget this little thing here because I hate mosquito bites and it's so itchy and if I cannot sleep because of the itchiness, I really have to use this. Oh, and not to forget my Ringana um, vein spray. This is really helpful if your feet or legs get swollen in the heat. This is the relief. Note myself, even though I only brought two pairs of shoes, it could always be that my dream pair shows up in Thailand and I could buy it because I have plenty of space left. Yeah, at least for one pair of shoes. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you are looking forward to our travel vlogs from Thailand. Until then, live and let live. Bye!